Hello, for you divers who uh, need an emergency uh, pressure chamber to test your dive watches, your dive computers, your silooms, your night lights, or even a small torch, uh, I've just got the answer for you. Uh, some people ask me uh, how do I manage to change my batteries in my dive computer and also test it before going for a dive. Well, this is how I do it. Amazingly enough, all you need is your household jam jar. With the type of lid that has a little rubber seal inside it, which when you screw it on it has a little button pressure tester. Okay, well, I won't go too much into that now. Simply, here is how to test anything up to six to seven meters in pressure. So, my dive computer. I've uh, changed the battery and checked the seal. Simply put the dive computer into the jar. Turn it so you can see your dial. Fill it up with water to the very brim. And as it's got a nice little bit of uh, surface tension on there, just place the lid gently on, push it down and twist tight. Now I'll show you the close-ups of this later, but all you have to do is push down with your thumb and you'll see the dive computer suddenly change, logs in to being underwater and down it goes and so far we're now coming up to 5.4 meters. You can go a little bit further than that by putting on the floor and actually standing on it with your heel. Make sure you have a carpet underneath so you don't crack the jar. And quickly looking at it, it actually went to about 6.7 6 meters. If you can see that carefully, you probably cannot, but I'll show you later in the close up. So there you have it, and the computer is still working quite happily. Not only can you test your dive computer, but you can also test the little night lights and even a torch that I left on for a few days. The batteries went dead, corroded a little bit. So uh, you can test that too. Pop that in as well. Fill it up with water. Now the pressure might turn the torch off. I might not have opened it up enough. However, pop the lid back on. And pressure. And the same again. You can see quite happily with pressure. Now I'm pushing this down to about five meters in pressure, remember. And five meters is where things like cameras and torches will start to flood and things will go wrong. You normally, if they survive more than five meters, you're okay. So there you have it. Pressure test, a pressure chamber made from a jam jar. Simple.